In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to set up the 8-Tree Smart Plug. Now this setup can automatically feed your plants by the minute. So you're gonna have to tweak your drip emitters and round off to the closest minute so you get the perfect feeds. First thing you wanna do is download the app. You could scan the QR code on the back of the plug. That's gonna take you right to the app. Download it, sign up, enable Bluetooth and allow access to home data. And then once you're in, add device. Make sure your plugs are plugged in and the icon you wanna select is the socket with Wi-Fi. Put in your Wi-Fi password and then it'll give you instructions on what to do. Put the power on, hit next, press and hold the reset button for five seconds. Then hit next, confirm the indicator is blinking. This is going to be a fast blink, blink quickly, and voila, now it's pairing. Boom. Rename it to something memorable. Hit done, and now you'll see it's on. You could add another device by hitting the plus, and that's it for pairing. So now on each device, you could power it on and off remotely. This is just off of 5G on my phone. And now that everything is off, I'm gonna teach you how to program. Now to program, you're gonna to wanna to select the plug that you're programming. This one is the Hydro Res. And once I'm in, I'm gonna select timer below. And in timer, I'm gonna add a schedule, right? I'm gonna select all of the dates and this will prompt it to switch on on a specific time. My lights go on at 10.30, so I'm gonna start feeding as soon as the lights come on, so 10.31, right? PM is correct because I'm utilizing the cold nights to keep my temps down in the summer. Then hit save, now go back out. So this is going to trigger the plug to turn on every day at 1031, but I still need to program it to turn off every day. So again, I'm selecting all the dates and now 1032 is what I'm gonna select. So every day for one minute between 1031 and 1032, I'm feeding the plants. It's going on at 1031 and turning off on 1032. I could change that to make it a two minute duration if I wanted to by going to 1032 and changing it to 1033. That'll make it a two minute feed. You really wanna measure each drip and make sure it's feeding the appropriate amount. You could calibrate this in a bathtub to make sure you're feeding the perfect amount. This'll ensure you're not overfeeding or underfeeding your plants. And that's it.